want to hear your story. Okay, the story is about three little cute pigs and a big bad wolf. Why? <laughs> Once upon a time, and a long, far, far away, there were three little pigs with their mom. Three little pigs didn't like their house, so they go to their garden and they just make some houses. Some pig, one of the big fat pig, made a straw house. And the medium pig made a, a stick house. And the baby pig made a brick house. Okay. But that time, the big wild wolf came there and saw three houses. And there was delicious food coming from there. And Mm -hmm. The wolf go to that door and said, Little pig, little pig, let me in. But, but the pig say, Not my hair on my chinny chin chin. But the wolf say, that, I'll huff, I'll puff, I'll blow your house down. <laughs> <laughs> then the straw house just break down all over. And the little pig run as fast as he could to the medium house with the sticks. And then the little pig said, Sister, can you open the door? There's a big bad wolf coming. The sister heard that there was a big bad wolf coming. And she opened the door and she, he get in. And then the big bad wolf came to that stick house and said, Little pig, little pig, let me in, let me in. But the two pigs say, Not our hair on our chinny chin chin. But the wolf say that I'll huff, I'll puff, and I'll blow your house down. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I'm blowing candles. Okay. <laughs> okay, now listen to the whole story. <laughs> then, the stick house fell down again. And the two little pigs go to their biggest small brother's house. Okay, and then, those, the sister pig said, Um... Brother, can you open the door? There's a big bad wolf coming. The big bad wolf was, was behind them. And then she get in and the big bad wolf arrived and said, Little pigs, little pigs, let me in. But the pigs say, Not our hair on our chinny chin chin. And then the wolf say that all oh, wolf and wolf and house down. <gasps> but the brick house was too hard. So the wolf tried, tried and tried to blow away the house. But he got tired. So he said, oh my God, I got really tired. I want to go home and eat just a little cheap. And then the little pigs go back to their home and bring their mom to the brick house. And they lived all happily ever after. The end. The moral of the story, we all pig cute baby animals must run away from whole big bad animals. The end. <laughs> wow. Why the TEFL kids are unique? Why? How we speak English so nicely. How? There is a secret. What is your secret? And that is phonics method of learning English by teaching. Phonics method? Yeah. Okay. And learning by teaching? Yes. What do you mean by phonics? Phonics means letter sounds. 
at Tesla, we did not say time. What do you say then? We say time. Uh huh. We did not say Q. Really? Yeah. What do you say? We say Q. Uh huh. We did not say please. Okay. What do you say? We say please. That's cool. And this way we practice. How do you practice? T -t 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 time. Uh huh. C -c 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 cute. P -p 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 please. And this is called filming. Dear parents, respected teachers, join Tessel Kids Center and let's make your kids like Rafika, Safwan, Jareen, Lamia, Sizda, Lubaba, Afifa. There are thousands of star kids like them. To register for the Kids English course, you have to send an SMS to us or you can directly call us to the numbers shown on the screen. Or you can directly visit our office. Let's start our journey. Let's learn together. Woo!